Hi guys, today I want to talk about charged particles in a magnetic field. Firstly, look at this nice little picture. Uh, what is this effect called? Well, it's called the Northern Lights. Actually, the Northern Lights is caused by charged particles being trapped in the Earth's magnetic field and hitting into the atmosphere. Here we can see an example of charged particles uh, moving in a magnetic field uh, in a bubble chamber. And as they move, uh, you can see some of them are spiraling clockwise and some are spiraling anticlockwise. We're going to discuss why this effect happens. And the bubble chambers they use to detect subatomic particles. So charged particles in a magnetic field. A moving charged particle is effectively a current. Therefore, by applying Fleming's left-hand rule, uh, any charged particle moving in the field will experience a force. A positive charge uh, particle uh, moving towards the field, okay, and the field is going inwards into the screen. The X's that you can see, the rows and rows of X's, that indicates that the magnetic field is going from north to south into the screen that you're looking at right now. Well. A charged particle uh, that's positively charged, it's going to experience a turning effect uh, around in one direction. And then a negatively charged particle, it will experience a turning effect in the opposite direction. And here you can actually see this effect uh, in real life. At the bottom there, we've got a uh, basically a very small little accelerator where electrons are being uh, accelerated through that tiny little hole. Uh, inside the glass there, there is uh, a very low pressure inert gas and when electrons strike, they make this lovely little kind of uh, purple uh, color. Uh, and there's a magnetic field, although you can't see the magnets uh, around the, uh, the glass sphere. Uh, there's a magnetic field and then that's making the electrons curve uh, upwards and around. So high-speed electrons in a magnetic field and a low-pressure gas. Okay, short but sweet. I hope that's been useful. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Goodbye for now.